Hi, this is Tom from 20th Century Rescue, and we're reviewing the Copeland Spode uh, plates, one by one. Um, there is crazing over all of them, I believe, and to varying degrees of severity. Um, this one doesn't appear to have too much. This is number one out of seven. Um, there is some here. It is difficult to see, except on one, where it's all very fine crazing. So there you see, um, <clears throat> excuse me, crazing on the back. I hope you can see it. Um, that's two. There are no chips. This one doesn't have much on the front at all, at all, if, if, if any, I can see. Um, but does have on the back a little bit tiny every here and there. That's three. Hmm. There, there's a little bit right there. See, it is difficult to see on some of them. There is some on the edge there. I don't know if you can see it there. Um, five. There is tiny crazing all throughout this one. Tiny, tiny crazing. Uh, move this over to the light here. There you go. So what you see on the back is generally what is on the front that you really can't see because of the pattern. So just know that. That's the worst one. Uh, so that's five. Six. And a much broader crackling crazing going on. And number seven. Right there in the center, you can see it right below the center large bud there. Um, not too much all over the place and some on the back as well so there's the crazing um, I will not accept any refunds or uh, returns because of the crazing or any misunderstandings so please uh, if you have any questions or need additional information please ask thank you and this is Tom from 20th Century Rescue